Hey guys, it's Jess and I'm coming back to you today with another prayer and gratitude journaling video. And this time we're going to be talking about Philip, another one of the 12 disciples. So before I start talking about Philip, I wanted to explain why my pages look a little differently today. So I ran out of the daily devotional pages that I usually use for these spreads. I, I ran out of those pages, but I really wanted to get this video up. So I just ended up using whatever I had. So this is, um, these are topical study pages. They come out of that same insert, that same spiritual insert. The, the insert itself is called spiritual and it's one of those inserts that you can buy for the creative year planners the recollections creative year planners at michael's so half of that insert are those daily devotional pages that i usually use and then the other half are these topical study pages that you're seeing right now so yeah i, I really wanted to kind of keep it consistent with those daily devotional pages but i ran out and so i yeah i just had to make this work so I ne I've never used these pages before so you'll see me do a lot of flipping through and a lot of just flipping through sticker books and changing up washi and things like that because I just yeah I couldn't I couldn't decide I, I still wanted to make this decorative enough to be a pretty spread but also have enough notes to get my point across so that's enough about that I um wanted to talk about the scripture that I use for this spread which comes from the Gospel of John chapter 14 verses 8 and 9 and prior to this scripture in in earlier in that book of John uh, in that chapter in that same chapter Jesus says that I am the way the truth and the life and no one comes to the Father except through me and Philip and so this is where we get this reference to with Philip so Philip said to him Lord show us the father and it is enough for us and Jesus said to him have I been with you so long and you still don't know me Philip so what I took from this is Philip and the disciples had followed Jesus for a while now and they still kind of questioned who he was there was still this little twinge of like distrust with them with Jesus so even though they were disciples and they were apostles and they were obedient they still had there was like a little part of them that especially with Philip where he you know Jesus said he's the way the truth and the life and Philip basically kind of tells him we'll prove it you know show us the father and I feel like you know from from our perspective as Christians, we kind of do the same thing where if something doesn't go right in our lives or something happens that just kind of shakes our world up, we we kind of distrust God, even though we know that he's never steered us wrong before. There's still like this little twinge of distrust and just this you want God to just kind of work a miracle or do something to just kind of prove that he's still there and he's still the same guy that you knew before, that you knew when you were saved and so so yeah I so I, I wrote that down and I, I wrote that in the little application section and on this side of the page because I had so many notes on the left hand side of that page I wanted to add like some flair and some decoration on the other side so I did this little visual representation of a holy trinity just referencing what Jesus was saying about being the way the truth and the life and no one comes to the father except through him and so I wanted to do a little holy trinity of the father son and the holy spirit and basically make a little note for myself and then just for reference to this to this scripture that Jesus is the physical manifestation of God the father on earth so you know there is that holy trinity so i just wanted to draw that and you know just kind of do a visual representation of that on my spread and then i'm just i there was a way the truth and the life sticker in that faith value pack sticker book i knew there was and they did not steer me wrong <laughs> I, I knew there was a sticker that said that so um i'm glad i found it and i'm glad it was pink so so yeah so i added that sticker to my sticker to this spread and i wanted to jazz up my little holy trinity up there because i just felt like it was a basic triangle so <laughs> i wanted to jazz it up a little bit so i found that silver heart in that and i think that also comes from the faith value pack sticker book so 
so yeah so I just decided to kind of decorate that a little bit but that's pretty much it as far as the spread goes um, I didn't like how my title of Philip was so I changed I swapped that out with um, with basically another sticker and then just wrote Philip again like I just rewrote it I just didn't like how it looked so I just rewrote it here and then those stripes kind of match the stripes at the top heading so so yeah that's pretty much it I also added like two more stickers after this but this is how the final spread turned out thanks so much for watching guys and I will see you in the next video bye